Do you hear it, guys? There's hardly an echo. Interestingly enough, we are in a rather heavy room from acoustic point of view. Above we have floating ceiling and porcelain stoneware floor. It's a hole, and it's always uncomfortable to talk in holes. Why? It's simple. The sounds are always reflecting, there are plenty of noises. Because of that, the conditions, acoustic conditions, so to speak, are rather uncomfortable. But our hall is not simple. It has big acoustic panels. I'd rather say these are music instruments. Yes, you got me right, exactly music instruments. But it's not something like produces sound like a flute or a saxophone. These panels absorb sound and do it extremely effective. These panels are most effective in sound absorption in 400-800 Hz range. These are the most disturbing frequencies that we hear and they affect our brain. Noise, humming sounds, disturbing vibrations, just imagine how sound bumps to one wall, reflects to another, comes to your ears and moreover if you're constantly singing, speaking. There are a couple of sound sources and two or three persons and in the end we get a medley like this. But if you have panels that absorb all of this on your walls, you get comfortable acoustic atmosphere. And it's wonderful, you know. Surprisingly enough, when I lean my ear against this panel, it feels like I'm listening to the abyss. I'd like to get some sleep in a room full of these panels. I think that would be a fantastic sleep getting any organism to a fully relaxed state. Most people don't even think of how all these acoustic factors can affect a person's life, making it either better or significantly worse. There is an interesting peculiarity of these panels. They are not only absorbing sounds, but reflecting them, making HF, high frequencies, more comfortable. The panels soothe them in a more proper way. That's not the best condition for a hole, but it's a must-have for an audio fan room. The fact the panels work is great, but it's also a question of design, how they are going to look in the interior. The design is out of question, it's cool and futuristic, in this case the panels are white, they can fit practically any kind of interior, mostly for a high-tech and minimalistic one. It appeals to me that these panels are enameled. If I was to choose white color, I'd clearly do it in this version. By the way, mate versions are available too. All in all, Vicoustic provides basically any color at your desire. Pink, green, red, if you please, no problem. Oh, a little piece of advice. If someone wishes for wood colored panels, go get it, you won't regret it. They have a great texture and they look just awesome on a wall. A small life hack. If you ever put these panels on a wall, try to leave some space among them. You better not to put them point blank. At the same time, the installation is simple. Use any construction foam, hold the panel for a couple of minutes so it won't fall off and it will be stuck for years. The panels can be easily stuck to paper hanging. The drawback of these panels is their price. They're quite expensive, but made in Portugal and supposed to be handmade, so the manufacturer says it's impossible to make them cheaper. Well, leave it on their conscience. Anyway, they were good. Also, I don't like the thing that the tone of these panels' upcoming batches not always match the color of the previous ones. That means you've ordered a set of these panels and a couple of months later another set came with the same color, but the tone is slightly different. Again, the acoustic explains this by the fact that production is handmade, so be it. One more thing, a helicopter, not a Mi-28, but the fact that panels cannot be perfectly attached. When you put one panel to another, some edge can stick out. You see, I've already mentioned this. The panels are put toe to toes and I think they don't look that cool as these with a little space among them. You can see the extent, how they stick out of the wall and it looks classy. By the way, the acoustics website as an option when you fill in your room's parameters, well, if you haven't done a renovation yet, to the point, what kind of paper hanging we would have, what's on the walls and the ceiling. You can upload the room's design and the company will estimate where and what kind of panels you should put. That's quite an interesting option, letting your listening room be transformed. There is barely a competitor to these panels out there. Of course, you can put acoustic polyurethane foam, but it looks not that cool to start with and moreover, it's not that effective. I've heard that the Japanese from Nihon Onkyo Engineering produce acoustic panels too, but firstly, they are far away, secondly, these panels have quite a stratospheric price comparing to the acoustic, and thirdly, their design is just creepy. In conclusion, it's a cool artist-built thing with hardly any drawback at all. Well, except for the price.